YouTube, Dubstep Slot 415, back again with a long overdue video. Got quite a few pickups today, so a little bit in the old sneakerhead Saturday style. Let's go ahead and get right into these. Starting off, we got the Secret Santa 2013 package put together by Indeed317. Bunch of different YouTubers were each given someone to uh, get something for for Christmas. My Secret Santa was Sneaker Dicted, but he has since changed his name on his channel to Heat for Feet 1234. I'm going to go ahead and put that across the screen. First up, got a Chicago Bulls Adidas Snapback. Black and red snap. Little design. You guys can see on the brim. Very clean snapback. Appreciate it. Got a <clears throat> Platinum Easy 2 keychain, Black Cement 3 keychain, the Sneaker Cleaner Restore Block, couple of plastic little sneaker shields, and my personal favorite out of the pack, this Nike Jordan 6 ring shirt. You guys can see he's got the 6 rings on his hands. Very dope tee, so shout out to Heat for Feet, one, two, three, four, really. Next up, we got a couple tees from Stacks and Kicks. Brooklyn, 44 fours, Holy Grail. Jay-Z rocking the Toro fours, Stacks and Kicks, all black tee. Moving on to the Stacks and Kicks logo tee, all blue. Very clean with the elephant print. You guys see, 100% pre-shrunk cotton. And remember, you guys can get 15% off using SK13 as a promo code. Don't forget that. Got a few things from my friends at beyondhype.com. Got the Spray Grounds Happy Days backpack. Got a silver reflective material all over the backpack. That's your little smiley face with the X's on the front. Very clean backpack. I appreciate it, guys. Then we got a few Rastaclot bracelets. Got this blue and white. The white, pink, and brown. And then a very nice autumn color one. So head over to beyondhype.com if you're interested in any of these Rasta clots and or backpack. From my previous videos, you guys should know that I'm a big fan of the Money Stacks backpack and duffel bag from sprayground.com. When they came out with this new Money backpack, definitely had to cop it. Got leather on the straps. The new $100 bill all over the bag. I'm assuming they will come out eventually with a duffel bag to match. Quite a few pairs of shoes today, including a very special custom collab. So stay tuned for that, as well as information on how to purchase. First up, we got two pairs of Cole Hans. One's on the right, picked up used from a buddy. Lunar Grand Saddle, dark gray, black, and Volt. Very, very clean Lunar Grand. Little minor scuffs up on the toes. Damn near got these for free, so can't complain at all. A touch of black suede on the heel and the side. It's your Volt outsole and your Volt laces. That's what it looks like with the black laces. Let me know what you guys think, Volt or black. Personally, I'm really digging the Volt laces. So this right here is a double up, Lunar Grand wingtip, poolside gray, one of the sickest Cole Hans in my opinion, got the all kind of like Tiffany suede, just call it uh, aqua, wingtip design up front, got your Lunar Grand outsole, all gray, little touches of blue. So very clean, very glad I was able to swoop these up. Moving on, I got two pairs from Packer Shoes. 
The one on the right is a new pickup, the one on the left is a double up. Let's get this one out of the way first. Question mid, white, sap green, and harvest green. You guys know, Reebok promo sample. Went ahead and picked up another pair of the LeBron question mids. Got your L23J on the outside. Your three on the back of the heel, two on the other shoe. But, was really digging these much more than the white and purple Kobe's. So when I was able to pick these up for like a hundred bucks, wasn't going to pass. Ewing Athletics, I'm going to show you guys the tag and then open up the box. Ewing 33 High, Sunflower and Black. Go ahead and open it up with the Ewing 33 Highs. <clears throat> this is kind of like a mustard yellow color. Very nice, kind of like, uh, think Timberland work boots. Or if you have the Nike Dunk VTEX or VTAX, should be uh, along the same color. Got your gum outsole. You can see the little basketball and card that come on all Ewings. Ewing on the tongue in black. <clears throat> Got that same extremely cushioned inner lining. One of the reasons why this shoe made it onto my top shoes of 2012 list. Every new colorway that comes out, I'm always digging. So far, the all purple, and now the all mustard yellow. Very clean. Continuing on with the next pairs. On the left, got the only pair I've bought off Nike in probably three or four months. On the right, got a pair from Nick at Sold Out Sneaker. Always holding me down on the SB releases. Nike Dunk High Premium, black, black. These are the Neck Face Chronicle Part 2 Dunks. The detail on these is pretty crazy. You've got lettering all over the inside of the mid panel and your toe box. Nike SB Dunk High Pro on your tongue. Your outsole is transparent. On the left shoe, You've got the KESB, Nike on the opposite shoe. Got your yellow hit on your midsole, excuse me, outsole. Black leather swoosh. Pretty nice suede for Nike SB release. So, Nike SB, well done on the neck face twos. So, here we go with the Jordans. <clears throat> A lot of people asked if I cop these. Air Jordan 5 Retro, black, cool gray, and white. The extra paper. I did swoop a pair of the Oreo 5s. As the years have gone on, my love for the 5s has gone down a little bit. I'm not as into them as I used to be. But, this is a very, very clean black and white colorway. When a colorway as clean as this comes out, just can't deny and say no, I don't want it. Clear icy blue bottom with Jordan in black. It's your black tongue with your jump man in silver or cool gray. So very happy with the Oreo 5s. For those who have been following my channel or my Instagram for a while, you guys know I've been working on a custom collab with Rome Customs. They have been completed and will be ready for purchase later on today. You can purchase those from roamtheworld.com. All the links and information will be in the description. Limited to 40 pairs. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Start it off. All Rome Customs come with your wax stamp certificate. A Rome exclusive pair, the Dub Prem Dunk Low. We have officially named these the Dub Premes. Based off the Nike SB Premier Dunk. Let's show you some of the detail. On the tongue, got Dub 415, a Rome exclusive. Same on the other. 
got elephant print added to the entire shoe went ahead and changed the toe to a black suede continuing on with your elephant print inside of your tongue exclusive to 40 pairs created and produced by the minds of Dub and Rome so we went all out custom tag you guys saw on the left shoe got Rome's logo on the back heel switch over to the right you've got my little dubstep slap 415 character so the official Nike SB Dub Prime collaboration between Rome Customs and Dubstep Slap 415. My personal favorite is with the white laces, but I did throw in the dark gray and then the university blue from Premier. So let me know what you guys think. University blue, that dark gray, or the white. Like I've got them all set up. Real quick, I want to do a little special segment for Domo732. He was the winner of the Dub and Rome custom collab giveaway I held a few months ago back when we were still working on these. This is your pair right here. Size 13, Dub415. Show you guys, size 13, all DS, dub preem dunk low, number 7 of 40, with your wax stamp, so you know it's authentic. Got your dub on the back heel, your Rome on the back heel of the left shoe. So Domo732, congratulations on winning the giveaway that is your pair but talk about how these were made I sent them the Nike SB Premier Dunks told them what I wanted we went down to the fine details on the custom tag there's actually <clears throat> whoever buys these there's a little message on the inside of this little loop you gotta unlace it and fold it back that does say something on all four of them how you purchase these, you head to the Rome website. Again, all of the information will be in the description. You need to purchase the shoes and ship him the Nike SB Premiers. Does not have 40 pairs in stock, so you need to send in the pair yourself. But this isn't some type of ridiculous collaboration. We're not charging five, six, seven hundred dollars. Send in your shoes, get the custom done. Be one of 40 with the exclusive pair. Just want to show you guys some of the detail before I get going. And this elephant print isn't painted on. It is actually burned in like all official elephant print. Again. A Rome exclusive dub 415 with the Golden Gate Bridge. So I can't thank Rome enough for helping me knock these out. If anyone is interested, follow the description. You can purchase them there. What's up, guys? Thanks for watching the whole video. This is a little short segment on my car. I've done a lot of work over it recently, so let's go ahead and get into it. 2013 Honda Accord. <clears throat> you guys know what the car is. Got the Belgian VMB5s re powder coated in a dark navy blue. 20 by 9 up front. 20 by 10.5 in the back. You do you see you got a little bit of tuck when it's aired out? Yes, I did put minions on my car. Got one on the other side too. Quick shot of the interior, went ahead and added a vipped out VIP table as well as some wood on the interior. 
Moving on to the trunk, which is the most important part. <clears throat> Turn on the lights. There you go. Got your custom Galaxy Hardline setup by Because Bags, Campbell, California. Got the Galaxy airbrushing on your air tank. 1000 PSI gauge. Hashtag Because Bags. Anodized purple hard lines. And you guys see the lighting is coming from two LED strips we added. We'll be adding some lights behind the tank, so hopefully that should be different in the next couple months. Thank you.